Hey guys, before I get started with today's video, I just want to let you know that the Richthofen rap is now available for download on iTunes. A lot of you guys suggested that, so if you like the song and if you want to jam to it, uh, you know, in your car or on your iPhone or something like that, uh, just check the description for a link. Thank you guys for the support. Hey, what up guys? My name is Jack or Mailbox, and I have a super interesting video for you guys today. A lot of leaks have been getting out about Black Ops 3 Zombies. I really don't like leaks. I really, really don't, uh, but I'm not even going to get into that. I just want you guys to know that I'm not just relaying quote-unquote leaked information about zombies. I'm not just going to sit here, uh, tell you about a picture, and then say forest map confirmed. Uh, that's just not my thing. Instead, uh, I'm going to talk about things and try to form some connections that might f*** your mind a little bit. Uh, so sit back, put on a helmet, and you'll see what I'm talking about in a second. Uh, so early last week, an image was leaked that showed the Black Ops 3 Zombies menu screen. Uh, the picture was taken at a Las Vegas GameStop event uh, of like two people. The picture was of two people, and it just so happened that the Zombies menu was right there in the background. Now, I can't show you this image in the video for copyright reasons, but if you haven't seen it yet, uh, Google is your best friend. Basically, the cool thing that we see in this unclear, uh, kind of blurry menu screen is the background. It shows a setting that we have not seen before, uh, or have we? We'll talk Talk about that in a second uh, but it shows a setting that is totally not the giant uh, it's totally not shadows of evil the two maps that we already know are going to be in black ops 3 zombies uh, it shows a dark snowy forest with dead trees and a blue glow uh, similar to the image that you're seeing on screen now uh, so this is definitely not a chicago city it's definitely not a german factory so it seems like this is actually a brand new zombies map that we're going to see in black ops 3 uh, one that hasn't been teased yet uh, but wait a second it totally has been teased uh, but all these YouTubers that love publicizing leaked information but refuse to dig beneath the surface uh, or try to form connections haven't shown you this, that we've already seen the forest map quite a few times actually. Let's take it back to the 6th of April when Call of Duty began teasing Black Ops 3 with Snapchat videos. Check this out. Listen only to the sound of my voice. Look familiar? Dead trees? Frozen ground? How about the next one? Let your thoughts drift. Let the bad memories fade. Let peace be upon you. So that one wasn't quite as obvious as the first one, but there's more. Imagine somewhere calm. Imagine somewhere safe. Imagine yourself in a frozen forest. Wait, 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 wait. In a frozen forest. A frozen forest. He literally said it, guys. He said a frozen forest. I mean, check these out. All of these have at least little flashes of the forest scene that was leaked in the menu. Now, I especially like this one because it gives us a little glimpse at a hut or a house, uh, which could be important. I don't know. Uh, but there you guys go. We thought that we were seeing the creepy frozen forest in the leaked menu for the first time. Uh, but once you go back, it's easy to realize that this was teased months ago. Uh, maybe I'm completely wrong. I don't know. But that would be one hell of a coincidence. So if those Snapchats were indeed zombies, teasers, then that implies that Dr. Salim is indeed a zombies character. Maybe a potential zombies campaign character. Interesting. So tell me what you think. What does this mean for zombies? If the menu and the Snapchats are related, then what does that mean for the storyline? We'll have to take a closer look at all of the other Snapchats as well with Dr. Salim. And uh, when it comes to that, you can definitely expect to see more follow-up videos from me. Uh, so thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video and you want to support my channel, I always encourage you to smack that like button in the face, but if you don't have the time or you don't feel like it today, uh, it's all good. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. It's been LM. The doctor highly encourages you to subscribe, and by that I mean I will kill you if you don't. No pressure.